after all that healing and dealing, let's say you still go through a divorce, what do you do with your old wedding photos? Ooh, question. Fans have noticed that Ariana Grande recently cleared her social media of wedding photos from her first day. This comes just days after it was reported that she was splitting from her husband, Dalton Gomez. Uh, what is your reaction to this? And would you scrub your feed of your ex if after a breakup? Ooh. I feel like... I feel like, you know, he, here's the thing why scrubbing, they say that scrubbing is for the person. Like, because in this time of internet and social media, nothing is ever deleted. Even if you delete it, like Ariana deletes it from her page, someone, thousands and millions of people have already screenshotted everything on her Instagram. So it's not really gone. So it's for her when she looks at her own Instagram to get a record of, of what she was doing, what she was posting. So based on that, I really like how thoughtful she was about how she deleted Dalton. So what she's done is she's deleted the wedding photos because the marriage is no longer intact. But Dalton remains in other ways on her Instagram because they had a relationship and continue to have a friendship. I think that's legitimate. I think that's real. And I think that's intentional and thoughtful. And maybe that's the guide that Ariana has given us when we do go through a breakup to, you know, really what pick if he and cheated? choose those photos. What if he did something really bad? Then, then what, by, by deleting it, as I just said, I mean, everybody else has her wedding photos. Vogue has her wedding photos, yeah. right? So if he cheated, I mean, it's a feet. message. If you're scrubbing everything about that person as a celebrity from, and then TMZ is reporting, oh, Dalton Gomez, which he didn't, by the way, that's not what's being reported. It's being reported that they're getting along very well. But if he did cheat and she scrubs, then we have things to gossip about. And on the social at one o'clock every day, we'd be like, what was Dalton Gomez thinking? <laughs> Or would it depend on the breakup and or how far down the line you'd have to go to find those photos? I, I mean, first of all, I didn't even know Ariana Grande was married until my <laughs> wife... <laughs> Yesterday, my wife said, did you hear Ariana Grande's getting a divorce? And I was like, who did she marry? When did that happen? <laughs> so I'm, I'm way behind on all this, but I'm a firm believer that if it's your social media, it's yours, and you can delete and as many photos as you want. If you want to go scorched earth on your memories, <laughs> that's up to you because it's your page. Do what you want with it. Uh, you know, uh, I, I forget to post. Like, I, I didn't have Facebook till I graduated college. I, the only reason I got Instagram is because my sister's in PR and told me I really needed to. <laughs> so I forget to post things. My wife is constantly reminding me, like, it's our anniversary. You should put a picture up. <laughs> And uh, so, so I, I'd be one of those, I'd get divorced and not even remember to take it down, no. you know? But, <laughs> but it's your page, do whatever you want to do with it. And especially, you know, if you want to heal and you need to take care of it, I mean, it's, it's pretty much the modern version of cutting your ex out of the Polaroids. Yeah. <laughs> Just going around and deleting them. Hey there, what did you think? Drop your comments below and join the conversation. And don't forget to like and subscribe so you can find more on everything from food and fashion to pop culture and current events. See you soon.